Good day, dear students. How are you? I hope you are fine. Let's begin. Before beginning our lesson, let's watch the video and then you should guess today's theme. Enjoy the video. What in the theme? The theme is animals. Today we are going to talk about beautiful, brave, strong, dangerous, amazing, fascinating animals. Lesson objectives of our lesson are identify specific information in short, simple texts, categorize kinds of animals using subject-specific vocabulary, Now you can see the word animals. Please think a bit and tell, say any ideas that come to your mind when you hear the word animals. Any associations with the word animals. Pets. Most of people have pets. And they are different. It may be cat, it may be dog, or it may be bird, but they are all animals. Dangerous. Of course, animals may be very, very dangerous. They may be small, different color. They may be yellow, white, black, brown, and etc. Big, they may be big, for example, elephant. Farm, some types of animals may live in farm. Domestic animals and the wild animals. Okay, vocabulary to our today's lesson. Bird, cos, cat, massa, cow, seer, dog, eat, elephant, pel, fish, bala, frog, baka, giraffe, giraffe, monkey, mammal, horse, jilka, Polo be palarla ayu sheep koi shark akula taiga rubaras spider gulmikshe bie zebra zebra lion arstan fox tulka wolf kaskar whale kit rabbit koyan as you mentioned above before there are maybe many types of animals for example wild animals farm animals animals which live in the water and birds just look through this picture let's do exercise number one look at this unusual picture of animals. In the first picture you can see body part of bear and head tile tiger polar bear and tiger. The next is half of it is giraffe half of it is fish. So a giraffe and a fish. Then this is sheep, but its head is monkey. So sheep and monkey. In this way continue doing this task. If we want to speak about animals to describe their appearance, facts, their actions. We should know their body parts. Here are given some of them. Nose. 
eyes, tail, beak, legs, wings, ears. Let's do this activity. This is matching activity. You should match the animals with their right descriptions. It is able to travel long distances and has a long mane and a tail. Now long mane and a tail and long distance, this is absolutely horse. The tallest animal in the world with a very long neck. Very long neck, it's only giraffe, yes? It has a brown thick fur and loves salmon fishing. Salmon fishing, brown, brown thick fur has bear. It is black with white stripes and lives in open grassy plains. Black white stripes. It is zebra. Then are the sentences do for yourself. Your homework is to complete this table. As you can see, here animals are categorized. Two pets, farm animals, wild animals, water animals, land animals. And some animals can go in more than one column. For example, birds may be as pets and as wild animals. And dog also may be as pet and as wild animal and a land animal also. These exercises won't be difficult to you, I think. The lesson is over. Thank you for your attention. Goodbye.